Hi guys, thanks so much for stopping by the channel. In this video, I'm going to be featuring Merge Shirts Under Jackets. So I have shown you a few of those before already. I've showed you the Fruity Plaid Untucked Shirt. I've showed you the Camo Muscle Sports Tank. I've also showed you the combination of the white cuffed open business shirt and the gray fitted suit vest underneath of fitted suit jackets or the long suit jackets. Those are all merge shirts. And by shirts, I just mean components that when combined under jackets on the male will allow you to merge items on the female character. So for this video, I'm going to be using three of those. We're going to be using the camo muscle sports tank, the combination of the open white cuffed business shirt with the fitted suit vest, and also a new component that I wanted to show you, which is under gun running t-shirts. It's going to be the sand t-shirt. And the reason that I need this one is because all of the other items here do not work under the biker cut. So what I'm going to be showing you essentially is how to do a cropped turtleneck with an invisible torso underneath of open parkas. I'm going to be showing you how to merge business shirts that look kind of like halter tops together with the whatever components that are jackets on male turn into whatever on female the examples i'm going to be showing you are going to be a bikini top as well as a checkered tank top i posted both of those examples already on my instagram and i have a lot of older outfits that i did with a way completely different method that show this cropped turtleneck underneath of open parkas and I kind of got this idea that it might work because T had uploaded a video showing how to merge together these business shirts. And I wanted just to see maybe the turtlenecks will work and it did. So I'm excited to finally be able to share a method like that that works with you for these cropped turtlenecks. And you can do this with these merged shirts under any jacket component. So we have lots of components now that equal merge components. So I will list all of these examples. They've always been listed on the component list. I'll share them in the description of the video if you do need to see them because I'm not gonna run through every single individual item for each outfit in the video. I'm just gonna show you the completed products here. And then you can also, if you'd like, use any jackets over these merge shirts to get the color of the outfit that you want it. You can do exactly as you see here in this video just to get an idea. But these will work under any jacket component to merge what I'm gonna be showing you on the female character, those items together with the items that the jackets equal. So for the first outfit here, what I'm doing is I'm gonna be using the components for the gray Stuntman high top canvas shoes with the gray joggers, a gray woodland open parka, and then I'm gonna be using a, a gray turtleneck on the female character, and I'll show you how we're gonna achieve this. I'm gonna be merging that onto this outfit. So this is gonna be the outfit in slot number one, and then when you get back on female, you need to make sure you have a spot either before or after this outfit on your male to save that turtleneck combination outfit that we're gonna be doing to merge it together. The second outfit that I'm going to be featuring is gonna have the red shiny open jacket. Now. If you've seen videos before, you know that this is going to equal a pink bikini top. But what we'll be adding underneath of it is going to be the white cuffed business shirt, the one with the open collar, with the gray fitted suit vest. And then because you can only wear fitted suit pants with fitted suit jackets and vice versa, what you'll need to do is make sure that you have a merge pant and a merge shoe onto that. And then I'm going to save a slot after that with joggers and a merge shoe that I wanted to merge onto that. And then another slot after that to merge some more high top canvas shoes, the pink ones, onto that outfit. And then the last outfit or the third outfit that I have here is going to be a combination of checkered and red items. So if you're looking for the individual components, make sure you check the components in the description. You can check the component list for more ideas. But what you need to do is complete whatever component transfer glitch is available to transfer these items from your male to your female character. And then you will load back in as your female character, hopefully with these outfits saved. And you do want to go to the counter to save your current outfit if that's something that you want it to keep. So you'll see here that we are not able to click on any of the outfits that we transferred over because they do have merge components on them. But I'm going to show you how we are going to set up the items we're going to be merging and why they work. So 
The first outfit, if you remember, is going to feature the gray woodland open parka with gray shoes and gray joggers. And how I'm going to achieve this crop turtleneck or these business shirts merging over is you need to go under fitted suit jackets. You then want to put on any of the boating blazers. And you can see here that any of these business shirts that are underneath of the boating blazer will merge into whatever item we had on the male to female as a halter top. So you'll get this color business shirt that looks like a halter top merged onto the item you had on the male, whatever it turned into on female. Or you can go under sweaters, under turtlenecks, and all of these turtlenecks that go underneath of these fitted suit jackets or these boating blazers will merge onto that same outfit, but it will merge as a crop top with an invisible stomach. So I'll show you what that looks like when we do merge it here, but you just want to select here the gray turtleneck if you're doing this exact outfit or whatever you're going to be doing if you're doing something different and save that in the slot either before or after that you wanted to merge it onto. And then we're going to just be doing the same thing for the rest of the outfits. So the second outfit, as I told you, was going to be pink joggers, pink stuntman shoes, what? and the fuchsia business shirt all merged together with that pink bikini top. Now I am going to cheat here later in the video, but basically all you need to do is save pink high top canvas shoes on the slot either before or after the joggers that had the merge shoes. You merge that together, then you would come back into online, you would put on the boating blazer with that color of business shirt that you want it, save that over that slot and then merge that into the bikini. So this is three slots. But because I already have an outfit saved that had the pink joggers and the pink shoes on it, I am going to cheat in the video and I'm not going to do the merge twice, but I'll show you when I do it here in a second. And then for the last outfit that I have here, I'm going to just be merging together a red business shirt that's under the boating blazer together with a checkered outfit. So you'll want to do that again with the boating blazer, find the shirt that you wanted to merge together with it, and then you will just simply save it in the slot before or after whichever way you're merging. So let's go ahead and get the first outfit merged together, and I'll just kind of show you an example of what the checkered outfit is gonna look like. I've already uploaded it on my Instagram, so I'm not gonna show that in the video. I'll just show you what it looks like in the video, and then if you wanna see the full product, you can go on my Instagram to check that out, and that's linked in the description as well as all over my YouTube channel. So now we have these outfits put together. In order to merge, we will need to start a Rockstar created versus job called Crooked Cop. You will need at least one person to join this mission with you. You can have a friend join. You can have a random join. Just set your matchmaking to open when you get into the job, but also make sure you have this set to player owned clothing on the first screen. Once you do have that set, hit confirm settings, and again, you can turn matchmaking on here if you're inviting random people. Set that to auto invite, and then you can just invite everybody from your current session, skilled match players, friends, crew members, whatever you prefer. I usually just do this with randoms. I don't wait around for people to do this for me as far as friends are concerned because I do glitches at weird hours. But once you do have at least one person in the job, just hit play. Now when you load in, you will have a screen that has an outfit selection. So what you want to do is merge to the outfit, or scroll to the outfit rather, that has the item you want to merge, and then scroll over to the merge component outfit. So here was the checker one that I mentioned that I'm not actually going to show completely merged together in this video, but what I'm going to be showing you first is the one that has the cropped turtleneck with open parka, the gray joggers, and then the gray stuntman canvas shoes. So you want to merge that together as you see here. I scrolled from slot two over to slot one, which put them together, and then you hit play. Once you do load into the job, in order to secure this and make sure it saves, you need to go to style, accessories, and gear. You can go right once for a rebreather. If you're wearing a modded hat or a colored hat or a checkered hat, you want to go left once and add an earpiece. I just simply added the rebreather, and then you just open up your phone, quit the job through your phone and now load into an online session where the outfit will be merged together and you can save this. Now, I will tell you that you can change this parka. It's a little tricky. You can basically change it to anything that's before or after the one that you currently have on and it will keep the glitched kind of top. But once you start to scroll over to other jackets and other shirts with this specific one, it will remove the glitched or the invisible part. So just keep that in mind if you're playing with it, but a lot of you are just gonna make this and not try to change it afterwards. And then, like I said, I was cheating here for the pink outfit because I already had pink joggers and pink shoes merged together. I skipped that step in the video, 
but you will need to merge the shoes together first with the joggers, come back into online, and then put together this outfit that has the boating blazer with the business shirt. I'm using the fuchsia business shirt here. Now you want to save that in the slot again before or after the slot that had the merge components on it, and we're going to do the same thing again with Crooked Cop. You need to start up a Rockstar Creative versus job called Crooked Cop. If you know how to merge, you can totally skip ahead and just wait until you see the outfit all merged together to see what it looks like, or obviously check Instagram or the thumbnail. Set that to player-owned clothing, hit confirm settings, and then invite some people to join the job with you. And I'll show you here what this ends up looking like. So I uploaded a video on Instagram, or sorry, a picture on Instagram that had a yellow and black bikini top merged together with the white business shirt, just so you could really see that these do glitch through. I should note that you cannot remove this glitchy bikini top from this outfit. And the reason being is when you do glitches to remove the glitchy shirt or the bib, it removes the shirt. Technically, what is considered the shirt here is the business shirt. So it will just remove the business shirt and you'll be left with the bikini top, which defeats the purpose of doing this glitch. <laughs> but once you do see this combined, you're just going to go to your interaction menu again. You go right once for a rebreather, left once for the earpiece, quit the job through your phone, load into the job, or sorry, load into online, and then you can save this outfit. So this is probably the best color combination one here as far as it matching with the bikini tops, but that's it. If you would like to, again, see the checkered outfit, look previous in the video in a, a different spot or check my Instagram. But thank you guys so much for stopping by the channel. Make sure you turn on notifications for all of my upcoming videos. Drop a like, subscribe, leave me lots of comments, and I will see you soon with more glitch videos.